guys, welcome to episode 32 of the Disgaea 5 Complete LP on the Nintendo Switch Triple Jump for happiness. Okay, uh, let's go into the like next thing. There has been absolutely nothing done in between this episode and the last episode, so Christo isn't more powerful. Uh, that'll happen at some later point in time. Well, he's more powerful, just can't move. This is flowerful, Blip. It's so beautiful. It doesn't look like anyone's trampled through here. Maybe the information about the magical spear landing here was wrong. We'll see. Since this is such a backwater netherworld, maybe they couldn't find anyone to threaten or subjugate. You look wistful, Sir Kelia. I haven't been here since I left Goldion's side. I didn't think I was ever going to step foot in this place again. Sir Kelia. Enough talk. If you drag behind, I'm gonna leave you. Kilia, looks like he's impatient, Plip. His family's netherworld might be destroyed. He probably can't bear to stand still, not even for a super millisecond. It's not just that. His destructive impulse is probably eating away at him as we speak. He acts like nothing's wrong with him, but I can sense the agony in his eyes. You know him well, Serafina Sis. No wonder you have such a big crush on him. Uh, I have a big crush? Don't be absurd! Sir Kilia is simply my servant. It's a master's duty to take care of their servant's condition, is it not? No, it's quite the opposite. Normally the servant is supposed to look after their master. Silence! Wait! Stop! I'm sorry! Hey, stop playing around! Let's go after Kilia! If we don't hurry, we're gonna lose him! Yes, Blip! It's Kilia's challenge this time! We have to support him! Okay. So one thing that was... Th this oh, just came up in my brain for absolutely no good reason. I wonder what, uh, oh, this is, this is the perfect alignment for the Neo Zeta Beam or the Rising Gale Wind or Rising Gale Force. Oh, damn. But for some reason in my brain, I was like, what's the, uh, what, what does Red Magnus call, what does Red Magnus call, um, god damn it, uh, call Christo in the Japanese dub? Because it, it's not a little sea stove, but that's the way it's like translated to me. So I'm wondering like, what the actual me too. Um, yes. like tra translation is, like the real name. There. Trying to kill as many people never run and away as few as possible. That is the basics of this game. You don't like fire or wind. Yeah, you have a high enough defense or resist so that I can't one-shot you. Because you're an annoying prickle. Yeah. Not sure if that's allowed to be said on YouTube, but I would imagine it is. Super reckless. If it isn't, oh well. Ha! 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 If you don't know what that's from, go watch some, uh, go watch some <laughs> old Cartoon Network, Dexter's Laboratory, Mandark, <gasps> or Mandork. Let me thank you. If you will. Yeah. Okay. Hey! Credit it, got in one. Sorry! And now they're not in, like, the perfect alignment for a move, which kind of sucks, because when you I see them in, like, best alignment possible. Like you really want to just hit it and get all of them out at once. But, unfortunately, twas not to be. Okay. Okay, let's just do this. Get those guys, take out that person. Come over here. Um, to toss you. Yeah. That way you can 
battle orchestra those guys. I'm just gonna leave Killian back here because he doesn't need any more XP than he already has. Um, what's the range looking? Yeah, I get you. Good. This map is really easy. Ready because now? maps that don't really have uh, like stuff you need My to abuse, power. like jumps and whatnot, are generally like really nice and fast. It's just like, oh yeah, like stairs. There's no jumping. There's nothing blocking my path except for like this. But even then, it's a relatively small map, which is really yes. nice. Yeah. These big maps just take a while. Surprised Rokin didn't get a level. He was that bar is really close to the end. Help me! Please! Don't take my life! Then hurry up and spill it. Where is the magical spear? It's I don't have time for this. Tell me! Kilia, please stop! I understand why you're impatient, but you're not acting like your usual calm self, Clip. Calm? I doubt that's the real me. Are you talking about your destructive impulse? That's the old Sir Kilia, not the Sir Kilia I know. I'm sorry. I'm hungry. I'm gonna go eat. Kilia? He's in rougher shape than I thought. Yeah. He's probably under more pressure than we can possibly imagine. Is there anything we can do for him, Flip? It's a problem with his heart. Ultimately, Kilia himself has to overcome it by himself. All we can do now is quietly stay by his side and support him. Nothing more. <laughs> you really can change when you want to. I never expected to hear that coming from you, Sarah. Love changes a woman. Seraphina Sis has some girly aspects after all. Now, let's go. Hey, old man. You still alive? No, I'm dead. <laughs> uh, I was expecting him to have like a conversation like, yo, we need to do something for kill you. No, I'm just dead. I'm dead, man. <laughs> what? But, uh... uh I, I find it kind of funny. Or interesting how they're always like, dude, kill ya. If you go rage, if you go like rage mode, we'll take care of it. Like we we can suppress you. Well, especially Red Magnus. So I'm like, bitch, no, you can't. You can't even suppress me normally. <laughs> like you are, like kill ya is by and far the best character right now. Let's like don't even. You up. <sighs> and like all the plot damage. That's the only damage they take is plot damage, and it's annoying. Seraphina, like, even though I feel like she was... I, I'm not sure whether or not she was faking it when she got slashed and, like, was on the ground, or if she just got better because of, like, the slight amount of healing that Krista was able to do. But, it's like... <laughs> I don't know what it's like. But Seraphina has flowers. But none of them would be able to suppress Kilia, especially in, like, his rage form. Such a temptress, you're really popular. That's right. Is what I would normally say, but unfortunately, I'm selling these flowers. Oh, these Lise flowers are Flowerful's specialty. I very much don't like the name, but they're difficult to grow, and they've been all the rage amongst netherworld nobles. Wow, super fancy people pay a lot of money for flowers that you can't even eat. Uh, you can't even understand the beauty of this flower. Anyway, we're for another world to be known for a flower. It's just biased. Toto Bunny was famous for its carrots clip. We 
we have distribution throughout the entire netherworld and we hold over 70 percent of the market our logo is a yellow pretty flip is that so does scorching flame have a specialty your specialty is the <laughs> inimitable heat you won't lose to anyone when it comes to heat is that a specialty let's tie it all together seraphina was gorgeous a specialty a river of golden sand, a waterfall of rainbow jewels. Too many to mention. If I had to choose one, it'd have to be me. Uh huh. Even the most beautiful jewel paling in comparison to me. Ah, uh, I'm such a sinful woman. Impressive Seraphina, she truly is temptress. It was stupid of me to expect a normal conversation. Yes, it was, Christo. That was very stupid of you to expect anything normal. But. I find it interesting because Seraphina picked the flowers to sell them, and uh, Lise, the character, got super pissed when Kilia picked one flower to give it to Lise. It's like, I thought you liked the flower! What the fuck? <laughs> um, yeah, no new ones. Unfortunately. Um, yeah, I already saved. Uh, Settings. Seraphina, you can. Let's do someone else. You know what, Margarita? You're my save icon for a little bit. Where would you like to go, dude? I really like the uh, the music in Disguise games. is always really solid. I, get, I, l I love Disgaea soundtracks, and I'm able to usually immediately notice when they use one. Like when some other channel uses a Disgaea game outside of its normal. It was the right move to follow the lost soldiers who ran away. Where we find the lost army, we'll find the magical spear. Uh, analyzing the situation is fine and all, but these guys are pretty good. If you're struggling against a small fry like this, then you fail as my servant. Seraphina, don't let your guard down, Plip. If you don't pay attention, you'll be attacked by the lost again. Silence! I'll never make the same mistake again. Where is Sir Kilia? He's eating something crazy! Uh, are you serious? He just ate a little while ago. How can he eat while we're this busy? Go tell him to stop eating and come help us. No. He needs to keep his calorie intake high to suppress his destructive impulse. It'll be more dangerous if the Tyrant Overlord shows. I got it! We have to get through this for Kilia's sake, Blit! Usalia! Behind you! Sorry. Thanks for waiting. <laughs> you sure know how to make an entrance. Are you all right, Kilia? You don't have to participate in this battle. Thanks to you guys, I've had a good rest. I'm fine now. Really? Yes. Now let's send the lost packing. Okay. So I just had to kind of chuckle at the delivery of that line where it's like, he's eating something crazy. Like, cause I, that, that was out of all the deliveries that have been. Okay. So that's why they decreased the window and cause there are some enemies that are weak to wind, but let's go that out of all the deliveries in this game, like some of them, are choppy. Like, I'm not gonna lie, some of them aren't the best. It's my turn. That was probably one of the primest, like, this is not one of the best I ones will yet. Never run away anymore. That was near, I don't want to say atrocious levels, because I'm, I'm sure, like, people 
doing it, or trying their damnedest like, to work with what they were given. Because this wasn't originally in English, it had to be translated, and it probably works a lot better in Japanese. But god, that, that delivery was just kind of hard. Here I go! Oh, Brave is back. Oh yeah, because Brave wasn't sent out. Um, can I, can I read their thoughts? We will fight or do I have to be like next to them? You said read thoughts with Y. Special. No, doesn't look like it. Uh, proud overlord of Fortress de Gaulle, he was moved by Kilia and the others' defiance. He will face any enemy. His overload, immovable Vajra, nullify all attacks for three turns, but be unable to move. Okay, that's not bad, honestly. Um, and then his ability, increase attack by attacks received times 5%. That's also not bad, because he seems to be more tank-based. With his HP being pretty damn high. Um, can you... I don't know how... You. Hey. You. I wish I did. Um, I guess I'll just end it here. Let everyone, let, let people move to me so they get all grouped up together. Worship Make me. Make it easier. Worship me. Oh crap. Oh crap. I wanna Worship me. Up. Worship me. I love hearing like the cut off voice lines. I can do it. I can do it. Let's turn it up. Uh, oh, they poisoned him. I don't like that. I don't like you for poisoning my homeboy. It's not cool. And you're tiny, so you can't really do anything. So... Uh, fortunately, you guys, I gotta eliminate you. Let's go! Just all clear. Because you're all scrub lords. And... Yeah. Uh, you guys are weak to wind. Well, this one doesn't have a effect, so I'll just do that. Yeah. Draw. Uh huh. Uh. I don't even think you can attack when you're tiny. Yeah, you can't. You can only. I believe it actually makes you take increased damage. Daddy's a badass freaking overlord. Because if we get. XP on the bonus list, I believe it also applies to her, which is very useful. Uh, and you know what, I guess, because I'm here, might as well just heal people. Yeah. Okay. Do, do, do. Don't overdo it. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Yeah. I'm wrecking all these bitches. Worship me! Can't tell I improvised that. Ugh. Musical genius. <laughs> no, not at all. I am actually terribly musically illiterate. I was in the band for like two years. Elementary school in Michigan. Played trumpet and baritone. Proud of myself. But not, uh, not the best at music. Okay. But rather just spent my time reading and studying. Well, doing homework so I didn't have to do it. <laughs> Julia. Shit! Hold on! I'm on my way to help you! Uh, I'm fine. I can still handle it. Hey, Kilia! Aren't you trying to carry more than you can bear? Why don't you trust us a little more? Kilia, aren't we allies? We help each other out when we're in trouble. The rebel army is a family, so don't hesitate to trust us, Plip. Usalia. Whew. Should we take a short rest around here? We don't have time for that. Destroying the magical spear is our top priority. Y you're awfully enthusiastic about it. <laughs> of course! 
We need to hurry up for Kilia's sake. Right, Sarah? Christo, can't you understand the emotions of an admirable girl who is trying to help the guy she likes? It's like they want to be shot. Let's hurry. You guys don't know when to quit. All right. We should hurry, too. Family. Do I even deserve to have one? A person like me, who got their family killed. Tell me, Lise. Can I rely on their feelings? Okay. Okay, that and other world research is complete. Let's fix you up. Get treated. What? What? <laughs> is nice I'll how make you it's complete. Just turns blue, so you know. Okay. I'm the strongest in the entire netherworld, Gee. That's a lie. You need to stop lying to yourself, you mushroom person. Let's fix you up. Which sounds like that could be like a slur against someone, calling someone a mushroom person. What? <laughs> But quite literally, he is a mushroom. A flowerful flaming sea. I mean, might as well. I mean, might as well do it while I have him. Oh yeah, those people I never thought would be leveled. Very high level. It's nice. It is nice. Okay, so let's save. Oop. Let's see. I like how you can sort of preview what they're going to look like by going down to a not-existent save. Boink. And then it's in color. So she is looking really uh, confident in herself. Okay, so let's go into abilities. Uh, I'm going to keep the SP growth. Decrease damage when attacking. Yeah, those are good. Uh, yeah, I didn't do anything with her. I did get a few of her things. So, in so Reverse Harem is actually a pretty good one. Uh, euthanasia normal attacks with death blow targets with less than 25% HP. Um, hit by 10%, I could probably get rid of you. Alright, let's see how much. So I have three spots. An SP growth rate is always just good. Attack range plus two with a gun is also really good, so I don't wanna don't wanna get rid of that. But attacking and we pen on one three. Um, yeah, I guess. I mean, why why have well? See, this is tough because hit is part of her attack sometimes. Not always, but sometimes it is. Let's see. Bunny hop, increased jump power by to four, by 48, and 50% damage taken on carpet last day. So, all ally units fully recover when they level up, which is a really good one. Increase it. Okay. You don't need XP buff, uh, boost, but I do want those to be there. So, let's do bunny hop. So now she has the jump of 85. So I don't need her to have any more jumping power. Um, veteran hero... Those aptitudes are good, because the better aptitude. So when moving after an attack, increase movement by, by two. Um, if units on the map and cutting a stage, all ally units on the map earn XP, which isn't bad, but it doesn't need it right now. You don't have any, didn't buy any for you. Swift stance, when defending, always counter attack. So I have enough space for that, so I'm gonna put it in, because if I do, Side like I can always just do it. So when making star element attacks, enemy stars always become zero. So capturing a prisoner. Well, she doesn't capture people that often, so I'm gonna get rid of that. And you can you can even save like presets, which is pretty cool. Um, increase SP aptitude. 
and SP growth rate. I'm not sure what the difference is here. Uh, and I do need three. Um, I'll just get rid of this one, put Starbreak in, and then put Mental Pain in again. Because Starbreak is really awesome in terms of abilities. Um, I'm wondering what the mana of all my people are right now. Okay, so they're doing pretty good in the mana department. Um, let's see if I can go increase Berserk Stream again for Usalia. Me? Because that's a really good thing to just boost up whenever possible. So yes, I can. So like, look at it. SP 524 to 1048. Uh, but it doesn't matter. Because the skills go down to be one when you're in revenge mode. Like, it doesn't matter that it's super, super expensive, because I can't use it unless I, it costs one. Which is just ridiculous. Uh, yeah, I can. I need to boost you. Like, straight out, I'm boosting you. Because I use you too much for you not to be killing people. Uh, and I'll boost you one time to plus two. Uh, I can boost you a couple times. Because in case I do need to use you, need, in case I do use you, okay, I'll bump you up. And I don't really use any of these <laughs> based on the fact that I just don't have a lot of fist skills. I know I don't use my fist a lot. Um, yeah, and even though you don't really have a lot of SP, I should probably just bump you up anyway. Yeah, like, you're not gonna be able to use them a lot, but when your moves are weak, then they're not. They don't really have a point. don't even have enough mana. Um, I use Spear Gates, so... Okay, so I made him slightly better now. Demon Solace, I guess. And you have SP. Okay. you all that often, but it's useful. I do also need to put your skills better in order. Um, yeah, let's do that. I found that I use Killer Spin a bit. Might as well increase my rush while I'm here. Because he doesn't have a lot of moves, surprisingly. Okay, so... Can't even enhance it. Well, I can enhance power, but then its base becomes 675, which means I'd be able to use it like a couple times. Um, I could. I will increase you. Uh, you're also good. I never used you because. Okay, so I'm actually going to enhance the power of the base ones, because uh, they're the ones that probably have the highest range and will be used the most, so it's not a bad thing to do. You can enhance both of you to be a little bit more useful because your SP isn't terrible. Time drive, 253. Yeah, I can do that. Mega Star. Sure, and then I'll also enhance the range of you. Enhance the range, enhance the range. Because there's nothing bad about enhancing the range of moves. Especially when you know you're going to use them a bit. 
course, me saying I know I'm gonna use it isn't really uh, true. Okay, we've been doing this for long enough. Uh, conversation. So, Seraphina's scared of something or angry. He's like, what? What's happening? Happened. Okay, there's a caterpillar. Not even a demon caterpillar, just a caterpillar. Calm down. Can't, can't. It's on my back. She doesn't like bugs, I guess. No choice, I have to activate the Netherworld self destruct device. Zero can get the caterpillar. <laughs> Zero can also doesn't like bugs. So, no time for that, Netherworld is going to explode. Alright. Got it. Really? It's true, it's not on your back anymore. I'm glad you may. We hate caterpillars, this is surprisingly, this is a surprising weakness. Pretty funny, I bet Red Magnus will get a kick out of hearing about this. You two, please keep this secret, or else they will literally die. And that's how Zoroken single handedly saved the fate of the Netherworlds blip. <laughs> she was literally just there to say he got it Let's and fix you up. he saved the world. Okay. Let's check if there's any new strategy assembly things, even though I believe they would say if there were that I could do. I could try this. But I would be using all my mana for a possibly, for a possible, like, not, uh, well, oh yeah, I do need to get better stuff at the store. Unfortunately, okay, yeah, it looks like I'm going to be using Kilia. Because it's always good to keep up on the store thing, which I don't believe I have been. Uh, you know what? Fuck. They deny me, I'll just fight him. Or pay him. I'm not at a point oh, where she's you. like, you know what, come at me, bro. Come at me. I think I can take you. Okay. So, subclass, you're almost done with the second to last star. I think you as well. You're on the last one, because that's the only one you've been on. Uh, you're doing pretty good. You're doing decent as well. I don't use you as much. Okay, Sage. Ninja. Archer. Just wanted to check all that, and before anything, let's save so I don't have to uh, do all that uh, skill shop stuff again. And where would you like to go, dude? Away we go. Do do do. do. Martial training, second trial. No, 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 no. No need for uh, more stuff. Road of bewilderment, bewilderment. Yes, I would love to enter the stage and get some more cutscene. I need a lot. You're having a tough time suppressing me. But it's useless. It's only a matter of time before I'm completely unleashed. That's because your heart wants an overwhelming power that far exceeds Void Dark's. You are suppressing me, but at the same time you want more power. You're just a cluster of contradictions, Kilia. You are me. Why are you resisting so much? I threw my past away for Lise. I don't want to lose the heart she gave me. Are you sure about that? You can't defeat Void Dark with the power you have now. Hell, you can't even fight the loss the way you want to. If you get killed, you won't have a heart anymore. It'll all be over. You won't be able to get your revenge, or protect your new family. You'll lose everything. It'll be the same if I unleash you. I'll lose everything that's important to me again. We'll see about that. What do you mean? Use your head and think.
Okay, so we just had a cutscene of I'll kill ya. Let's end this quick! Uh, and enemy base panel. So, I could potentially end this in one turn, but unfortunately I don't think I have, like, the range. when you memorize like oh yeah i know this person has a move that will hit in this exact way that i need to yeah. like, I need it to it's just going to be like okay cool yeah. all men yeah. are my servants yeah i'm just gonna, gonna jump yeah. up yeah get up get up get down uh and you're defending you bastard i love you bastard Shotgun craft you for no good reason. Even. Sorry, you have massive jump now. It is your duty. Eh, duty. Um, I'm actually just going to throw her closer to the wall. So she can jump up and have a higher move. Because I think she can reach. Yeah. Damn it, these people. You. You. Good. I'm glad they attacked him and he countered both. <laughs> Three characters surrendered. That's that's actually decent. <sighs> Red Magnus. Is that the end of them? Done yet. Bloodus. Hmm. You don't have to be so surprised. Where is Red Magnus and the others? Did you? I don't know. They could be dead already. Wh what did you say? Novice. Ugh. Don't give in to your enemy's words. And it's a rookie mistake to worry about others. What you're doing is ridiculous. I... I can't die... here. Yes. Unleash me. Unleash your true power. it. Show me your true power. If you want to die so much, then die! What fearsome power. It's amazing that you were able to suppress this much power within you. 
You stubborn bastard. I'll end this quick. <laughs> Looking down on me. That's why you're still a novice. Your fists cannot catch me. Why? I should be able to wipe the floor with Void Dark. Anger, hate, arrogance, sorrow. Your fists are full of evil. But what's clouding your fists most of all is your hesitation. Hesitation? How idiotic. I'm not like that pushover Kilia. I'm Tyrant Overlord Kilidia. No, you are who you are. You only have one heart and one body. But your heart is scattered. The doubt in your heart is making you weak. The hesitation in your heart is hiding your true power. Uh, I... I always thought there was another me inside myself. But you're telling me that it's just doubt that's in my heart? Who... Who am I? Kilia! Are you alright? I'm glad we made it in time, Blit. Looks like you had quite a lot of fun without me. Are you alright, Sir Kilia? What do you want to do, bro? Want to try the final skill again? Uh, bro? Looks like we've been interrupted. We shall postpone our fight. As long as you have doubts in your heart, you will never be able to defeat me. Hold on! There's no need to chase him, Red Magnus. Why do you say that, little Sisto? Because when we go to destroy the magical spear, we'll definitely see him there. Sir Kilia, what happened? Okay, so that was that was actually kind of interesting because you see Bloodus. I don't want to say helping Kilia, but he's definitely like affecting him. Which is like, no, like that that dark you, it's never been there. It's just you doubting yourself. And like before, he would he like he's trying to make Kilia stronger. I, I like to have a better fight, probably. It's just like, oh yeah, like you you can't beat me. Let's There's no way. You up. And before you was like, oh, show me your show me your true power before, and now it's just like, well, your true power is amazing, but it's still not enough, so long as you your don't content. really believe in yourself. Um, I'm actually going to put it all into weapon mastery. And see what this does, because as of right now... I don't see my weapon mastery again. I don't, I don't remember. Equipment? Yeah, here it is. So he's a. Uh, he is vastly more sword based. Her gun is a lot higher than her bow. Attack monster. Surprisingly, his fist and gun are approximately equal. Uh, his spear and axe are about equal, surprisingly. His bow is a lot higher. No, his, uh, I think the reason why his magic is a lot lower is because I, he doesn't have, like, attack magic. They're, all his attack magic are unique moves, which goes to whatever is equipped most. So I want to see if I can uh, up some people's levels in that stuff. Uh, so let's go... First let's save, because don't want to have to do a battle and cutscene again. Uh, hi Krista, what's up? So... Zrogan's counting. 
because that seems to be hard for him. What are you doing? As you can see, I'm training so that I can stop Bro whenever he goes out of control. That's admirable, okay? I have a body of steel, I'll absorb any kind of impact right away. I don't think it's good to absorb it. You should probably dodge it, right? <laughs> I mean, if you super get hit by my punch, it won't affect you. Stop it, Remagnus. You don't want to get crap on your... You don't want to get crap on your prideful fist, do you? Sounds like super fun. Let me hit you. Please don't get started, you two. Anyways, I won't accidentally destroy Fred Magnus' fist, so it should be alright. Now, I have a good idea what's going to happen. Because, I mean, it's pretty obvious. You hit me with all your... Hurt. God. You alright? <laughs> cough, cough, barf. Sob, sob, er, it hurts. I'm gonna die. As that, as you can see, it didn't hurt at all. Even though he literally just said, oh, it hurts. You can be full of pride after you wipe everything up. Oh, uh, that, that's a good one. Uh, okay, so now let's go over here. I want to I talk to Zerokin to start this one. Christo, you're always wearing glasses. Do you have really bad eyesight? No, I have 22 vision. Really? That's amazing. Oh, I'm guessing it's because two is the eye covered by hair. <laughs> then you don't have any reason to wear glasses. Unless it was supposed to be 20-20 vision. Then they just forgot a zero. I can't tell you why, but I do have a good reason for doing this. I'm mysterious. My heart is throbbing. Clip. <laughs> I'm not wearing them because girls dig them, or because it builds character. The truth is, if I take my glasses off, something very terrifying will happen. <laughs> terrifying? What is it? If I take my glasses off? Pause. Dramatic effect. My eyes turn into the shape of the number three. <laughs> so that's that's a classic anime manga trope, where like when you can't see your eyes just squint and they look like threes. Got hopes up for that lame joke. He needs to be punished for it. Let's take his glasses off and write the number three on his face. Wait, stop. I'm sorry. We should take his, we should take his horns as well. My horns have nothing to do with it. No. Don't. <laughs> uh, let's, let's look at the equipment and just see, like, what stuff's going on. So you can always buy the thimble, but right now, uh, we can do Dragon Buster. Which, for... It's, like, not as bad. Like, we're catching up with, like, the sort of non-increased stuff, well, although this one's like a level 11. So I'm actually wondering... Yeah. So as you can see, like, it's not that much worse than this one. Of course, you should go into, like, the item world with it. In old, in older games, what I used to do was, uh... Actually, maybe I can increase it more. I just need to buy more stuff. Hmm. Welcome. What I used to do was, uh, I would buy the latest item, and then item world it for like 10 levels and then I use that and then every single time I upgraded the uh, shop I would just do the same thing again and again and again okay, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna buy one of these because you never know people in the uh, whatever might like them and it's always good to just have um, like, you know what boom gonna buy no, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that at all. Uh, but there are people that just uh, like things. So there are people that like glasses. So let's buy a couple hundred glasses. Uh, there are people that like defense items. So let's just buy some rinky clothes. People that like monster items. So let's just buy some of those. Uh, oh, I can't hold any more items. Hmm. <laughs> I forgot that there was a... Yeah, there's 2,000 items. Ha! That was not very well thought out of me. I'm a dumb. Okay, so let's save here. On oh, a new save. And let's go into the strategy assembly. And try and pass some stuff. Um... So these... I've never really done these. So let's... No, let's try it. Fluff up nine tails, tails. Nine tails is tails. So, okay, so this is what it does. It means all the, they like symbols, which I don't really have much of, unfortunately. And if you give things that they're not very interested in, then, uh, uh, 
must have that, so yeah, let's just give it to him. In favor of... See, I'm wondering if you can increase their favor by just, like, not even caring. It's just like, oh yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fight them. So it doesn't even matter if they like me or not. <laughs> I wonder if that's how this would work. Because this is basically... Basically what this meant is so you can go give them bribes. And I believe because their affection for you uh, stays, like, retained, it doesn't really matter. Uh, Imperial Seal... Yeah, I'm not going to be using these. But because it, like, persists, it doesn't... Uh, I, 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 I. Awesome. So this is just meant to be like a point in time you. where you can be like, okay. Um, you can just keep doing it, or... Uh, I'm wondering... I'm trying to think up the people that... Um, <laughs> you know what? Let's try. Let's try this one. I have a lot of items now. I'm pretty strong. Red Magnus is attending it, reckless. so he'll do. He'll do some stuff. Uh, okay, 109, 46, 11, 11, 11, 172, 256. But you're strong before me. 109, 172, and you loathe me like orbs. I wish you liked. I wish you liked monster items or glasses. I did not think this out very well. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna have you now. Um, 109, 256. What do you like? You like hands. I can give you hands. Yeah, just take all my hands. I don't need them. Okay. Cool. Do you like anything, Red Magnus? Um, what do you like? Oh, you like monster weapons. Awesome. Yep. That's going to continuously hit this. Okay, he loves me. Is there anything beyond love? Doesn't look like it. Okay, so that is actually useful. So that, that's me now, that love is the max, after total support. And what do you like? You like orbs, you like spears. Okay, what do you like? You like orbs, you like orbs, you like- all these people like orbs. Screw those people, man. Okay, total support is good. Um, you like hands. What do you like? You like fists? Okay, loves me. Uh, you like fists. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Because of my stupidity, I now essentially have to try and find ways in which to get rid of massive amounts of items. And it doesn't really matter. It honestly doesn't. Because, so what, I'm giving away, like, decently high-level items. Uh, and he flexed his biceps, so usually main characters, if they're attending, are able to get rid of, uh, some of the negative parties. In case we are going to fight, or they're able to change what they're gonna say. So become battle buddies with Plein Air. I became comrades with Plein Air. Is there anything else? Doesn't... doesn't look like it. I can meet with some other parties. Uh... will surely be denied, because you can just try and get money from them. Of course, it doesn't cost a lot of hell. Yeah, you're now able to make Planair an ally at the special- Okay, so she was DLC back in the original. Receive content. 
Okay, special character. I mean, receptionist of the Pocket Netherwood Strategy Assembly Planner will join. Stay tuned for Planner's activities. Yeah, I'll receive that. Obtained her save icon, which is awesome. Planner, one of my favorite characters, so... Uh, not best girl. Not best girl of this game, unfortunately. But she is one of the better girls of the franchise. Um, so she's level 65. And let's check out her stats. So you can see her aptitude for speed is insane. So she is definitely a gun person. Uh, idle assist increased stats of ally units on the map by 10%, which is awesome. Uh, and look at all the shit she has. She has a shit ton of magic. Uh, this goes by int int, but that might just be because of what she has equipped right now. I'm not sure what she does. These gun moves, which is pretty awesome. Uh, she doesn't have any subclasses. Uh, Harada's mascot has been getting more screen time lately, a regular contender on popularity polls. So, she is actually resistant to all forms of magic, and her gun is S class, her staff is A class. Pretty high level on both. What's her equipment? Usagi picture book. Okay, it's not bad. So, let's give her a gun. Absolute shit close. Oh, you're good. There's a way to skip down more. Oh, if I just hold ZR or LR, it skips down more. Exactly like I wanted. Cool. Air sneakers, angel shoes. Yeah. Put that on. What's her movement now? Her movement is now seven. So that's good. Um, I like plein air, but I'm probably not even gonna be using her all that much, awesome. so let's just put her in a squad. Um, what squads are there? Capture squad, that squad, skill training squad. It's not bad. Boot camp, channeling, relief, stats. Um, def no, let's 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 put her in the in the squad. Uh, and because she has DLC, I will. Uh, rearrange my characters. Oop. Manual. Because I'll actually put her above Magical Penny. And what I do need to do is go into specials for um, yeah, there. Gospel power. Um, yeah, those are all better now. And then Deicide Shooter. <laughs> plein air. What is she? You know, like a zombie bunnies help plein air. Cool. So with that, I am going to say that this episode is over because we're almost at an hour. Oh, look at her. She's just holding that bunny. Oh, yeah. Love it. So, Buddy Bison signing out. I hope you all have a very nice day. <laughs>